And we're back with another Mafia Definitive Edition video. Part, I don't even know, Moonlight. Plan stays the same. Right. I take care of the crowd, you handle the manager. Threats don't work. Do what you gotta do. Keeps yes, the sir. Keys on them. So you tell her sounds the alarm. How long do we get? Five minutes. Maybe more. For the cops show. What if it all goes to hell? I'm not fucking around, Tom. We hear gunshots down at the vault. Don't come up. It's the money or nothing at all. All right. Damn, look at that face. You doing this? Face look good. We're doing it. Stay where we can see your pretty faces. Anybody moves, I'll pop them. Get the manager. I need you all to stay on the ground. All right. I see movement, people start getting shot. Everybody stay where you're at. With me, down to the vault. I'll do whatever you say. No one needs to get hurt. Yeah, that's right. This make you feel big? Beating on a little guy? It's making me feel rich. And the little guy gets to walk away doing? if he doesn't do anything stupid. Yeah. How many Try guards at the thing. vault? One. You gonna shoot? I don't know. If I see a gun, he gets a bullet. So you tell him to stand down. It's all on you. Okay, go down there, bud. Everything okay? Manager here is being good and cooperative. We're all doing what we're told, aren't we, buddy? Keep moving. You won't get away with this. Your sort never do. You just worry about yourself. You want to yeah. see your daughter Dude, graduate from high I'm school? You. you keep your hands where I can see them and tell your guard to do the same. Yeah. You just keep walking, buddy. Remember, when we get to your guard, you tell him to drop his gun. You got that? Ah, oh, shit! Listen to me very carefully. Put down your He's all sick of boys! Said there was only one guy. Get to his side! Damn. Y'all motherfuckers lying? Vault keys on the table! No one else has to die! I don't have to die! Yeah, no you don't. Oh. Jesus, Mary and Joseph. <laughs> Wake and moan it! Oh Damn it. shit. The cops are here! Let's go! Get the money, it's time to go! 
All right, let's go. Oh, crap. right there. Alright. Just run to that piece of cover. There's a fucking go, Tommy. cigarette thing. Okay, let's go. Kill on sight. We got more cars en route. Get everyone from the station. Get in. Get in. What are you doing? Get in. Go, go, go! Where? Anywhere! Just lose the cops! Where did these guys keep coming from? God damn. Yeah. Alright, take this uh thing over here. Oh. Alright, make a left. Oh. oh shit. Okay, make another left. Oh. Right hook. Make another right hook. Yeah. I've got calls saying that the suspect is over in Oakwood. I'm getting calls saying we lost sight of the guy. Officers in Oakwood, stay alert. Extra, extra. News from overseas. Hitler on the march. Oh, jeez. I've got time to be talking about Hitler right now. Club. Sam's club. Hey, it's empty right now. But you don't know, can't hurt him. Okay. Here we go. Get us. Get the 
fuck, that was a fire hydrant. Out of my way. Watch how you fucking walk. We're almost there, Tom. We've almost done it. It's still almost, Polly. We'll only have done it once my heart stops trying to beat outside my chest. Oh, jeez. All right. We fucking did it. We did it! I can't believe we fucking did it! We're loaded! We're loaded! Yeah. For all time's sake. Sure. Ah! We gotta go. I'll see you tomorrow. Unless I'm halfway to Hawaii. Oh, come on. I'm kidding. Hey, I couldn't have done this without you. I know that. Go home, celebrate with Sarah, come by my place in the morning, we'll split up the dough. Yeah, okay. Good luck. See you around, pal. <laughs> All right, mission complete. I think this is the, the last mission. This next one right here. Well, look at this. Christ has finally risen. I was getting ready to call the coroner. Sorry. Had a bit of trouble falling asleep as all. Me too. Thanks to you tossing and turning all night. Okay, what'd you do? We're just feeling lucky as all. Got that right, champ. I've been thinking. Oh, yeah? I'll call the papers. I've been thinking about taking you and a kid out to the shore. You serious? Ain't you working? Polly and me, we've come into some money. Huh. One of his cracked angles finally pay off? Yeah, something like that. Yeah, Take a few bags. Like I'll swing by after I go around to Polly's. What ain't you telling me, Tommy? Nothing. Sure, you and Polly are suddenly flush, and now you want to leave town for a few days? That's on square. What's the point of making a buck if we can't spend it? That ain't it. You're moving, even when you're standing still. Yeah, you're nervous about something. Polly, you don't even know why yet. Well, that must be it. You better figure it out before you get to Polly's. Just in case it's him that got you all wound up. <laughs> Polly's all right. Don't worry about it. Well, I guess I'll see you soon. Yo, is there anything? <gasps> there is something inside my house. Hell yeah. Oh wait, there's still another thing. Yo, I'm trying to pull a fast one. Man and wife. We've been married for four years. Oh fuck. My bad. You still here? It was an accident. I didn't mean to break that fucking lamp. Keep going.
Jeez. Oh my goodness. Better not say shit. Oh shit! Oh shit! God damn it. I opened up my mouth too damn quickly. Stupid cop. Making me slow down. This neighborhood's going to the dogs. Hey, hey, what happened to you know? this last night? Uh, I've been working nights. Guy in the apartment above me was raising hell again. Oh, was that Polly? Uh -oh. Polly! God, Jesus. Polly. Polly. Answer it. Holly. Sam, it's me. It's Tom. Where's Polly? He's a uh... He's dead. I'm looking at him, slumped over in the hallway, torn a fucking skull. Oh, God. I was... I was calling to warn him. About what? Jesus Christ. I owe you fellas my life three times over. Warn him about what, Sam? Salieri. He found out about the bank job. You're in deep shit, Tom. You gotta disappear. Okay. Uh, uh. Okay, uh, I just need some cash to get me and the girls out of town. Can you swing that? Sure. Anything, pal. You want me to come to Polly's? No. No, I can't stay here. Uh, meet me at the, the city gallery. Yeah, okay. Keep your head down, Tom. I'll uh, see you soon. And uh, thanks, Sam. I always pay my debts, son. You know that. Damn. Not fucking Polly, man. Oh no. Polly. I gotta go. I'm sorry. Yeah. Is there anything up here? <gasps> there is. I fucking knew it. Oh, comic violence, damn. Damn, fucking struck me where it hurts, huh? Huh, game? I'm gonna call the cops. Something ain't right. Someone said it could have been gunshots.
The only person who knew about that shit was Sam. Is he setting me up? That sly dog. Better not be setting me up. I swear I'll put a cap in his ass too. Damn, I fucking got out that bitch quick. Don't move, Tommy. Shit. Hey, Tom. Sam. What the hell's going on? You and Polly you put me in a bad spot. I know, Sam, but I'm sorry about that, but I need to get out of town. Can you help me or not? There you go again. Making me choose between my friends and the family. This is what you were looking for, Polly's. Here's your cut. It's more than you deserve. Sam. You killed him. You killed Polly. No. Polly got himself killed. And you seem real tore off about it. I'm just in a good mood. Things are right between me and the Don. I'm moving up, and I just found this big bag of money. The Don knows about Frank, Tom. The whore, too. That whore. The girl you were sweet on. You're the one that let her live. I'm sorry about this, Tom. But our business has rules. Shame, too. Don Salieri really liked you. Guess we'll both have a good cry at your funeral. You think you're doing this because you're loyal, but you're not. You're just scared. Maybe. But you would have lived a lot longer if you would have just looked over your shoulder from time to time. Goodbye. Don't let him suffer, boys. He's my buddy. Oh, shit. Grabbing cover. How do you hit me? That's some bullshit. Oh, 
don't gotta do shit when you're dead. Getting covered, come on. Reload. Oh shit. Grabbing shit when you're dead, bitch. So much blood. Look at all the blood. That's some bullshit. What? Damn it. Man. If I have to restart all the way, that's some bull. Oh shit. What the fuck? No. Grab this fucking ammo. Or not ammo, hell. Guys, yet. Still not over, Here. Oh, shit. Damn it. He's <laughs> trying to run away from that shit. All right, I think I got a checkpoint when I kick down that door. So hopefully, uh, be able to just start right here.
All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Running out of guys yet. Salieri was ripping us off. Ripping you off, baby. There. Finding cover. about drug money is it pays for a lot of muscle put them down boys kill it oh, hey. Show them on the radar. It's hella cheap. Peek out, bitch. No room for punks like you in this town. Over here! Shoot him! Molotov! Oh, shit. Down my semi automatic pistol. Tired of this life, Tom. <clears throat> I know that. I've seen it grow in you for years. But now, there's only one way out. And I'm the guy that gets to give it to you. Oh. Nobody's carrying you to the doctor this time, Sam. You kill me now in the dawn. She's never gonna stop looking for you. But you let me live. I'll tell Salieri you're dead. You can disappear. Just like Frank. 
Only you'll be smart enough to stay gone. Right? What happened to him? He was hiding out in Europe. <laughs> what a dumb bastard. He started betting at the dog track. Got spotted by a friend of the family. So Salieri, he sent out a crew. And his family? that little voice in the back of your head. Maybe sounds like your baby girl, Sarah. Always telling you not to pull that trigger. And you can't make up your mind. It's getting easier every time you open your fucking mouth. <laughs> we sure had some laughs, right? Remember that time? Me? You and Polly you... God damn. Sympathize with the situation, Tom, and I want to help your family, but I can't do anything unless you're willing to testify in court. You understand that, right? You'll have to sit in that box, stare down Salieri, Ralphie, Vinny, maybe even Sarah's father. I, I don't know if you got the stones for it, if I'm being honest. I'll do what needs to be done. But you need to get my family new identities and ship them far away from here. Well, hold on. There's a long road between us sitting here bumping gums and Sarah sleeping under new stars. Then I'm sorry I wasted your time. And mine. I gotta get out of town. Look, Tom. I got a family too. Wife. Four boys. All Irish twins. Yeah. So you know I understand what you're going through. All the worrying over them, the fear that one of them's gonna go before you do. But this case, it'll be one of the biggest this city has ever seen. It could drag on for years. I don't know if I can protect you for that long, not the way things are downtown. Everyone's gotta eat, right? Even dirty caps. Just being honest here, I mean, there's a few bodies I can trust downtown, but not many. And if it comes down to you or me taking a bullet, I'm not gonna make my wife a widow. Keeping you alive in exactly the moral course, but I'll try. That's a pretty good sales job. Trying to make me think you got nothing on the line. But this is your whole career right here. However it works out for me, whether I live or die, you get to crack the Morello case and take down a Don. Salieri will be your legacy. Don't go thinking you know me, Tom. Salieri belongs behind bars. I'll help you so long as you help me put him there. That's all this is. Then that has to be enough. All right, epilogue.
long time ago. In another life. Someone once told me that family is a man's Achilles heel. His greatest weakness. Maybe he was right. Because everything I've done, both good and bad, I've done for my family. I've turned my back on people they thought were my friends. I've kept a lot of hard promises. I spent eight years totally alone. Trying to find myself so I could come home. A better husband, a better father, a better man. Now that I'm a lot older and just a bit wiser, <laughs> I see that family is our greatest weakness. But it's also our greatest strength. It gets us out of bed in the morning. It lets us chase our dreams, even when they're moving too fast to catch. Uh-oh. It keeps us from falling over. When we're too tired to take another step. Mr. Angelo. Yes. Mr. Salieri sends his regards. Tommy! That's okay. You're safe now. Remember that money, jobs, even best pals will come and go. But family, family is forever. Damn, those bass hits though. Damn, that's a, a little bit of a bittersweet ending. It's music though. Hangar 13. Man, that game was... You know, I felt like the difficulty could have been a... Uh, a little bit in the player's flavor. Fave flavor. Favor a little bit more, but uh... I, I like some of the difficulty. I like the, the driving. The shooting was still kind of atrocious. The falling animation was kind of atrocious also, but, uh, you know, the, the story really was just so, like, enticing the entire time, like, I really felt like I was watching a, like, a Goodfellas type movie, not The Godfather, because I kind of think those movies are a little overrated, like, I appreciate, uh, some of the scenes in those movies, I think they're really good, but there's just too many of them in there, so goddamn long. But, uh, yeah, this is a great game. I don't know if I'll play through two. I do have three, so I could play through that. But, uh, I don't know. It just uh, took a long time to get through. Like, I'm, like, halfway through. Like, or actually, not even halfway through. I'm I think I'm still at the beginning. Shit's long as fuck. So I don't know if I'll, I'll play through that. But, uh, yeah, I think uh, the next game I'll play through is... Call of Duty Modern Warfare, not uh, 2019. Uh, and then after that, I don't know, maybe I'll uh, stop trying to play some newer games. I'll, uh, I'll stick to some of the games I like. Like, uh, I really want to play through the Dead Space series, especially 3, because uh, I made my friend download that game, so we could play it whenever. So... Yeah, you, you guys have that looking forward to. 
so hopefully I can uh, get that done. It's November right now, so it's, uh, it took me like a month to finish this game. <laughs> but uh, Call of Duty, you know, it's only like five, six hours, so uh, hopefully I'll be able to get through that a little quicker. And, uh, Me playing a bunch of video games, showing you how bad I am at most of them. You know, just uh, just having fun with you guys, sharing sharing my fun moments. That's uh, that's kind of what this channel is meant for. So hopefully I can uh, bring you as much content as I can. And man, look at look at this cast of characters. These guys were amazing voice actors. I don't know if they did motion cap. I wouldn't be surprised if they did. Uh, when the original game came out, I don't think they had technology like that, so I really did dig the performances. I thought they were all great. And yeah, this is a this is a, a great game. This is definitely one worth playing. Classic game, and yeah. I'll just uh, be quiet while the rest of the, the credits roll. Excuse me. Uh, if I had to rate this game, I'd probably give it an eight out of ten. Mainly, mainly because of the story. The story was very engrossing. Uh, some of the gameplay. I bet you it's a lot more improved than uh, it originally was, but I feel like the shooting could have been uh, a little bit better. But yeah, 8 out of 10. Great game. Definitely must must buy. Oh, dropped my controller.
these are some long ass credits. 